All right, what's up, everybody? I'm in the Dean's Bridge Walmart. Easily say that this Walmart has the biggest reputation of being the worst Walmart because of the area. But what I found myself is this might be the best Walmart in Augusta, hands down, hands down to the ground. First of all, before I say anything else, I was greeted as soon as I walked in and it wasn't just, hey, it was good morning, how are you? Bada bang, bada boom, walk to the store. When, you, when you're on the outside of the store, when you come into the store, it looks old. So you're thinking, you know, it's gonna be an older store, but um, this store is actually one of the cleanest stores I've seen. When you walk in, pretty much same layout, polished floor, everything's in order. Uh, I mean, I'm just kind of shocked because <laughs> all the reps, I came here a long time ago, it wasn't like this, but uh, the manager here is doing his thing. I'm gonna show y'all the store now. Very, very clean store. All right, so usually one of the things I love doing is walking aisle to aisle and seeing how consistent it is aisle to aisle. And this store was pretty good. I ain't gonna lie, it was clean. Everything was in place. So this is great. The one area that I usually see at Walmart that are filthy is the clearance aisle, the clearance racks. Um, this one isn't dirty at all, really clean. And also the electronics department where I am now is neat. Everything has a place besides a couple things that could have been customers. You can usually tell when a customer has done something versus <clears throat> negligence. In some of my videos, y'all gonna see <laughs> the negligence. <It's> good. <laughs> but here, a lot, everything is in place. You know, um, every, every, every product has a home and it's one of the best stores, period, um, that I've seen so far. All right, so in other stores, I see a lot of DVDs. That's one of the indications of details. The DVD section's always out of place. You know, TVs everywhere. But this one, it seemed like every place had, every product had a place. Every product had a tag. And in these big aisles with the gondolas in the middle, uh, it just seemed like it was a plan to do it. I mean, I know it sounds crazy, but it's just, it's a uniform. All right, so I'm going through the clothes right now. Generally, in the clothes area, you'll see clothes. I mean, <laughs> a lot of different things out of place. And granted, I am going in the morning, but still, like I said, as you can tell, a lot, most things are in place. The store is ready, man. So you can see it's enough space. And as you walk through, everything's in place. Everything's where it needs to be. You know, you got your down in the middle things in the middle how they're supposed to be and even in the clothes aisle you know this women's clothes you know about besides that little paper there everything is clean and in place you know everything seems to be tagged right you know they seem to have their right quantities out jewelry counter beautiful <laughs> everything's out everything's in place everything's tagged it's a good indication of a good store to me once again clean aisles no paper, no trash, no dirt, no dust. <laughs> Very rare <laughs> from Walmart. Once again, belts. Y'all know how them belts can get ugly. So one thing I'm going to say about this store, this might be one of the best kept secrets of Walmart and Augusta to me. This is my own opinion because based on what I'm seeing, it's a well-organized store. You can clearly say somebody's got a plan. And I actually saw the manager walking through, picking up things, grabbing baskets. But the one thing that I noticed about this store is everybody spoke. Mostly, most people, most of the associates, regardless of what department they was in, they make eye contact with you, they speak to you. Now, how is it at 8 o'clock at night? I don't know. But based on what I've seen so far, this might be one of the best Walmarts especially if you want to go shopping <clears throat> you want to see a big store a store that has a lot of different things in it you know it's clean you got all kinds of different no inventory issues um you know aisles are clean uh if you want to kind of go to a store where you feel like <laughs> i hate to say this if people care about you this might be the place to go clearly
Once again, you see uh, jeans, slacks, whatever you call it, everything's clean, everything's neat, everything's in place. This could be, maybe, the biggest store, maybe. Um, it seems big, maybe, I don't know how to, it feels big when you walk through here. Pause. It feels big. Um, this might be one of the biggest stores. Possibly. Now what I would recommend if you're shopping at this Walmart is to come early in the morning. It seems like obviously all the stock is out. Everything's neat. Everything where it's supposed to be. And this is really a really a good place where you could probably get some help. Um, I saw a couple customers getting directed to the right places. I didn't see attitudes. I didn't see them getting passed around. But I believe that this could be a place that you could go early in the morning and you can get the help you need uh, during the holiday season, especially early. And it has one of the biggest clearance departments I've ever seen. <laughs> and maybe I haven't seen much, but whatever. It's huge. Yeah, very, very clear toy aisle. It could get chaotic over here, but it can, you can clearly tell they stocking. You dig? Sam Owl. I will make a note. Somebody talked about the music. The music is too loud, man. God, Lord. <laughs> I can't even focus on how beautiful this bike section look. Because the music's so loud. Y'all got to turn the music down, man. Turn the music down. All right, so like I was telling y'all, it's probably one of the cleanest, clearest departments I've seen. And besides it being clean, it is a lot of stuff. So if y'all resellers or whatever y'all doing, Y'all got stuff on eBay, secondhand, whatever. This Walmart can hook you up. Very, very clean, huge clearance rack, clearance aisle, clearance area. Ton of stuff, man. Y'all want some deals? Go to Dean's Bridge. Y'all get all the deals, depending on what you're looking for. Go to that store, man. It's crazy how clean it is. Outside of the store, very, very clean. Not any trash. Everything has a place. It's a beautiful day. Beautiful ball. All right, so I'm leaving this Walmart right now. I'm telling y'all, if you're in Augusta area, you shop in Augusta area, it might be worth your time to take a trip to this Walmart. Obviously, it's a little out the way if you don't live on this side of town, but as far as value, you're gonna get a lot of value out of this store. Because one, the staff seems to be friendly. They want to seem like they want to help you. It seems like everybody knows what they're supposed to be doing. It seems like the store is big and spacious, full of stock, appropriately decorated. Cleanliness is on point. Um, I didn't check the bathrooms, but I feel like I didn't have to. Um, so, like I said, this is probably the best Walmart. If I had a chance to go to Walmart, I would come to this one. I live so far away from here, so I won't. But this is a really great Walmart and it might be the best kept secret. I'm gonna let y'all know. We're gonna go a couple of them, peace. Quick note, I'm, I just was driving out the parking lot and they had somebody way in back in the parking lot getting all the baskets out too. And they're like, oh, well, you know, you now you just, bro, that's what they're supposed to do. I don't see these things happening at Walmart, ever. I don't. I see baskets all over the place, parking lot's dirty, store's dirty. So excuse me if I'm excited about going to a good Walmart.